Hello everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video, as you saw by the title, we will be doing my Ulta haul, my 21 Days of Beauty haul. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited about it. I honestly haven't done a lot. Okay, I haven't done a haul. I haven't done an, a, a, a regular haul, traditional haul in a while. I do and monthly makeup hauls, but I haven't done a traditional one. So I'm really excited about it. Um, it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, and yeah, if you like these videos, definitely give it a thumbs up. If you want to see any of these products in action, if you want me to do a video dedicated to um, any of these products, definitely let me know. Comment down below. Um, yeah, hit the subscribe button and the bell. And without further ado, let's just get started. Every time my makeup is like different or like out of the ordinary or like a little bit more than um, just a regular tra 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 regular everyday shade oh my gosh and my nails are blue what's wrong with me in the blue oh my gosh i didn't even realize that but today i use the laura los angeles sleigh bell palette come on come on i always think about what is going on i always think about decluttering this one because i just don't use it too often but when i use it the looks are so good i use the shade jolly here um on the lid and that is that beautiful shade um the shade right here wish list is in my inner corner and then the shade cherry chocolate i was gonna call it chocolate the shade cherry chocolates on my lower lash line and like a hint of it is in my crease and then i have just a regular um uh transition shade in my crease from a different palette but omg i love this palette and i cannot wait to use this green um i don't even know when but when i feel like it i'm gonna be using a green that's one thing i love about this um the only one of the only things i love about being stuck inside is that i'm kind of getting more and more creative with my eyeshadows because like there's nowhere to go that people could be like, whoa, your makeup looks too bold, you know what I mean? So I could just play, you know? And then my lipstick real quick, finally using the Joa All Brushed Up Creamy, um, sorry, the Joa Concealer in the shade, sorry, not, I mean, sorry, 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 sorry. I'm finally using the Joa Lipstick in the shade, um, sorry, not sorry, and it looks pretty good. I have a gloss on top of it, the Kylie Gloss in the shade, oh, you fancy, on top of it, but... Um, I think that should be it for the shout outs. <laughs> My bronzer too, I'm obsessed. It's the new Ofra bronzer in Americano. I just got this in Ipsy. It's new to me, not new to life, but um, yeah, I think those are all the shout outs for real, for real. <laughs> um, I don't know. I like doing it because I feel like I like doing this because of course you guys can, um, can look down below for like the details and stuff like that. But sometimes like me telling you, it just, it, it's just, it makes more of an impact. And so I needed you to know. <laughs> my found okay 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 sorry last one for real for real my foundation is the color pop pretty fresh and i put it on and i wasn't super excited about it but now looking at it it just looks gorgeous so i don't know girl i love that one too that was the last thing for real for real <laughs> all right let's jump into the haul so the first two things um i picked up this was the whim this was the whim purchase the first whim purchase and it was actually because these were not on the 21 days of beauty list so if you looked at like the pamphlet or whatever these products were not on it these are the persona lip glosses they're just called the lip glosses i think and i have the peach gloss and the toffee one so now these were not on the sephora thing i'm sorry the ulta like list of 21 days of beauty items but then the day of can't even remember it was in the first week though um the day of they came out and they said new, but then they said they were on sale for $8 each, and um, they're originally 16 So I got them both for, obviously, $8. It was kind of like a buy one, get one situation, which I loved. I was like, yes, please. Um, and these are the two shades that stood out to me. Now, the best part of the whole thing is that Ulta was doing uh, free shipping over 15 that week, and so... Um, it was so good. It was like perfect because then I got free shipping, got two glosses. It was great. What a life. Um, and so we can swatch them. I've been using these. I've used these a couple times and I like, I love toffee. I mean, I love both of them, but I do love toffee because I feel like toffee is a little bit more like the peach one. You could tell it's peach basically. And so it's like kind of a certain look kind of thing, but I still, I love this formula guys. I don't know what it is, but I'm in love. So here's toffee right here and here's peach. They are so stunning. It's not even funny. They're beautiful. And they came out and I snapped. I was like, I need them. I need them. And like, of course, I don't need them. <laughs> but I was like, I just, I needed to get them. So I did pick these up. Again, they weren't a planned thing. So I, I and, I, and I actually bought them at like 2 a.m., 3 a.m., something like that. I had rolled over. I don't know. I was awake looking at Ulta. I was like kind of trying to kill time, like trying to make myself fall back asleep. And I ended up going to Ulta and it said that it showed those. And I was like, what the heck? Well, then funny thing, when I woke up the next morning, they were basically all sold out 
I think mostly sold out. Um, a lot of the shades that I wanted were sold out and so I was like I'm so glad I got them in the AM. <laughs> okay next I placed a little order. It wasn't really like I didn't need anything but um, it was free shipping over 15 and I was like <laughs> let's do it. So I picked up Wet n Wild was doing buy one get one 50% um, off and so I picked up the Wet n Wild concealer. I'm trying to do a wet full face of Wet n Wild and so I was kind of getting things for that. I picked up the Wet n Wild photo focus concealer in the shade medium tawny. Now I'm wearing this in the center of my face. It's not under my eyes. I have a different concealer under my eyes, but I'm wearing it on my chin and like through my nose and it looks really, really nice so far. So I have to try it under my eyes. I was just scared today. I didn't want to look bad. So I was like, I'm not going to put it under my eyes. And not a lot of people love this concealer. So it was kind of, it was literally something so that I could just do the full face went wild. So it was nothing spectacular, but, um, you know, so far I like it. It was only a couple bucks. So I think there's like under four bucks. And then again, you got the buy one, got one, and then I got one 50% off. The next one I got was the Wet n Wild Mega Mega Glow Makeup Stick. I got the contour, again, like for my full face of Wet n Wild. And Jessica Brown loves this contour stick, and I wanted to try it so bad. And so I got the shade Oaks on You, which I could have went, I, like, I, I, I don't know. I, I didn't know what color it would be. So it looks like it's going to be a nice, nice color. I haven't used it yet, but, um, um... I don't, I don't know, I just, I, I have a bad, hard time picking shades, and since this one was the one that I knew people talked about, or like I've heard Jessica Braun talk about, I was like, let's just get that one. So, we got that, um, and then Cat was having a bit of a sale. It was really funny, because once I placed this order, the next week, Cat was, had more products on sale, other products that I was eyeing that weren't on sale the first week, but also had up their shipping back to 35 and so it was like, Fine, whatever um but i ended up picking another concealer this is the j cat stay assurance water sealed zero smudge concealer it's a long name i got the shade cappuccino which so far um it seems like it's a little dark for me right now okay it works with the foundations that i wear because all my foundations are too dark for me it's just it's just it's fine because i'm not going anywhere and you can't super tell super that much but once in like regular lighting you can tell a bit um but so this one gets a little bit dark for me and like my skin tone but for my summer shades and my summer foundations this will be a really really nice concealer um and so so far i like it you can see it's just it gets super dark and it looks like almost my foundation shade yeah but it, it, it'll work with certain foundations and um stuff like that so i don't feel like I, I need to return it or get a new one um i probably won't because i also have concealers that are too light for me and jada 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 like there's plenty of ways to make this work it's not that big of a deal but i really really wanted to try this concealer for a while and it's like eight bucks which is not a lot but it's a lot for like it's a lot for just trying it to try it you know for no other reason than just to try it um it's a lot of eight dollars is a lot for that because i'd rather get something that i know and love or like something that i want to try for a video or something like that like then I, then then it's fine but so I picked it up, it was on, and it was like five bucks, I think, and so I was really excited about it. And then they also had these blush, blush mellows, soft blushers. Um, this is in the shade, um, where is it? Sweet and Chic, and this is so beautiful. I've used it once, but either way, it's so pretty. Once you get it to a nice blended out shade it is so stunning especially for spring i'm in love i gotta use it more but um i'm in love so 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 freaking in love look how beautiful um so this was a couple bucks as well i think like three dollars or something like that originally they're super cheap but like on sale it was even better um so it was a great deal um and i needed to pick up a new one <laughs> i need another cream blush for no apparent reason, uh, no apparent reason other than i wanted it <laughs> um and so yeah we picked up this girl and then last but certainly not least, so you guys know I love the Essence Day at Hour Lip Liner in the shade because duh, well she was running low and um, instead of repurchasing this one, I wanted to try this new shade. This is the shade um, Tea Time, so I picked this up with my order. It wasn't on sale or anything, but it was, um, I needed a couple more bucks to get to the 15. Um, I know. That's great, right? But I need a couple of bucks to get the free shipping, so I, I just threw this in there. And um, I thought this one was going to be like a more nude kind of shade, but it's not. It's a little bit just darker, more purple. It's just a very different tone. I thought it was going to be similar to, to Because Duh, but it'd be a little darker, but it's not. Um, so well, this one will probably use up. I'm going to try to like put this more into rotation once I use up the Because Duh one, because um, before I rebuy the other one, just because I did buy this. But um yeah, if you if you have to pick one, if you're like, which one one should I get? I'd get because duh, it's the best one. But this one is a pretty shade as well. You can see it there, but not as good. Alright, so then the order that I was waiting for forever. Um 
So this was all basically the first week when they had the $15 shipping. And then they're probably, and honestly, quite honestly, it really annoys me Ulta did that because the second week and the third week well first of all when i was when those ultimate 21 days were first announced um i was really excited because they do pick up in store um and so i was like well it's perfect like i'll just order and then pick it up in store it would have worked out great so then when all the stores closed it really was like dang and so um um all to lower their shipping and that was great but they only did it for the first week so in the second week i wanted some stuff and i was like well i'm not gonna pay an extra six bucks for shipping and then um i think they took away the coupon or something like that or maybe they didn't i don't know but either way it was just certain products don't have you can't use the coupon and it's like i'm saving money yes but with this sale but then i pay an extra six dollars for shipping and then an extra buck for tax it just ultimately is not worth it and so that really annoyed me um that first um the second week and third week so that's why i didn't pick up that many things but then this last week the last week i think it was on the second or the third of april um they had the buxom glosses on sale and so this was the this this i knew for facts going in there um when the also 21 days of beauty started these are the only products that i was gonna get were the buxom glosses but then the persona ones came and then um they had 15 dollars shipping <laughs> and then so then i did get the glosses um i got two different shades here i was screaming my head off i love the buxom glosses and i tried a mini of the dolly shade which i got again a long time ago and i loved it so much and then i haven't gotten it um since in the last 21 days of beauty that they had these i missed it and i was so hurt i was so hurt so i got the buxom it's the full on pumping lip cream and i got the shade dolly in that one which is so beautiful. I'm going to swatch it because um, it's stunning and I haven't used it yet. And these have like a tingling sensation that like make your lips plump and I'm so excited to wear them. There's that one right there. And then I picked up the um, same formula, the what are you full on plumping lip cream that's very weird because like then they have like a full on I'll show you in a second they have like a different kind of full on lip thing but this is the full-on plumping lip cream just to remember just so you know and i got the shade white russian which everyone and their mother talks about as well and so i needed to try it um there's one other shade i can't remember the name of it there's one other shade that i was like hmm but i was like i'm gonna max gonna buy two just because so it's kind of like buy one get one half off you know so here's the shade white wash russian and i'm so excited to try that one as well oh my gosh oh and so those are full size for 20 you get them they were originally 21 dollars, and i got them for 10 50 each like that's an amazing deal i saved 20 bucks 21 dollars basically um well then they said as i was adding these to my cart again this was at the a in the ams in the ams in the am where is it crap i left it in the other box because there was oh sorry i'm saying sorry to my hair i just put lip gloss in it. i'm like sorry <laughs> um i left it in the box because it wasn't that exciting but they said if you spent $25 um $25 on buxom products you get a free five piece set so I was like okay I was like mercy you cannot buy another gloss because that's just too much money that's like freaking $30 so I ended up buying the buxom pencil sharpener Ooh, the buxom pencil sharpener um it's just a little sharpener thing I think it was like six bucks or something like that it doesn't have a name uh uh um the price on it but i think it was like four to six bucks or something like that and maybe thinking about it like because i ended up paying shipping anyway like maybe it would have been just as good to buy a no because then it wouldn't have equal 35 either way long story short i picked this up um just so i could get the 25 dollars and then it came with a free five piece set and i was shook to the core i was like i need that so the most exciting thing is it obviously comes with a mascara, not obviously, the most exciting thing is that it comes with a mascara. This is the Buxom Lash Mascara, um, Black is Black, enough said. Um, I want to I want to try this so freaking bad, but I'm actually getting the same mascara in an Ipsy, so I think I'm going to give this one to my sister or one of them to my sister, I don't know. Either way, I'm not going to open it right now, but um, I was like... Oh my gosh, a free like deluxe size sample of a mascara. That's an awesome deal. Um, and then you give me five other products, like even better. So they actually give three different shades of the, um, okay, they're the, let me read them. So, okay, okay. Am I confused? Yes. So they gave me two samples of the full on plumping lip polish. So it's supposedly a little different than the um, lip, what are these called? Plumping lip creams. 
Um, and so I got the shades Celeste and then the shade Dolly again. So actually I was like, oh, I'll just give these away, but they're different and they're different formulas. And so I'm going to try them because, um, it's still exciting. And then they're super, super duper small. You can see they're mega tiny. So I felt like it was fine to just justify keeping them. Um, but um shimmering pout plumping shine for singing simulation yeah so they're supposedly different because they have that shimmer to them the lip polishes have the shimmer that the uh other ones don't have and so i'm excited to try that one and then obviously the shade celeste i don't have um anything in and it's super super shimmery so i'm excited to try that um the the only like i have this kylie gloss that i'm wearing right now Ooh. And it is super shimmery in there. It looks beautiful, but you can feel the chunks. So it'll be nice to see if you can feel the chunks in these. And that'll be a good tester to see if, like, you know, you want the full size. And then it comes with a, okay, this is the full-on plumping lip cream. So it's the same thing. You know, maybe I could give this one away to my sister. This is the, um, yeah, full-on plumping lip cream in the shade White Russian. I thought this was going to be different. I'm not sure. But either way, maybe I'll give this one to my sister as well. Um, because I have that but um, again super exciting you get five little mini products that's super cool so then the fifth product is actually a va va plump shiny liquid lipstick from buxom of course it's in the shade wine me and it is super red red but I don't have any red lip products and um, you know sometimes you need it I guess it's like again it's like a wine color like it said so it's not like super super red but I think this is perfect because it's super small um, and I don't wear reds that often but when I do I'd like to have something and so this is a good little guy here. I don't know let me you guys know how I should count these as my inventory. Should I count them each as like half or should I count them as a full thing because they are something I still have to use up but I feel like there's no way that this little thing should be equivalent to this you know what I mean like that in my brain doesn't make sense so I don't know. They're less than, this is, these are 4.2 milliliters and these are 1.5. Like, they're not even, they're less than double of that. So, it's like, I, I, I don't know, girl. I don't know. But, um, so anyway, really excited about that. Um, and yeah, that was really it for my Ulta haul. I got four lip glosses. I know, who am I and why? I bought four lip glosses and two concealers, which is like stupidity because those are the two categories in my collection that I don't need any more of and I was just like I don't know what I was thinking but I really wanted it and so it was really fun and I really needed this today because honestly recently like um when I get bored obviously I scroll down Ulta and Sephora and I don't need anything and what gets me is always like I literally hate buying something and then having to wait for it to package to come because then I still get antsy. Like, I don't feel satisfied. Like, when you go to the store, you pick it up and you can bring it home and play with it. Like, I don't feel satisfied like that um, when I order it online. And so it's like, stop. So I needed a package to come in so that I didn't buy another thing. You know what I mean? So this was perfect. I'm really excited. I'm super excited I got a mascara for, like, free. <laughs> so the scripture for today is, ooh, where am I? Exodus 15 <laughs> verse um 26 yes he said listen well to the voice of the lord your god do what is right in his eyes listen to what he tells you and obey all his laws and if you do this i will put uh i will put none of these diseases on you which i have put on the egyptians for i'm the lord who heals you um i think it's just an although like you can take it literally he'll put it on you the way he put it on the egyptians but you can um take it another way just trust in the lord god and listen to him and his obey him and you'll be free of diseases free of any harm and um because he's the one who heals you and so thought that was a good one thought that was a good one that's it for this video guys i really hope you enjoyed it again subscribe give this video a thumbs up tell everybody and their mama to subscribe let me know if you want to see a tutorial on this eye look i'm obsessed <laughs> bye guys